Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to design this simple uh, screw M5 screw. This is furniture screw and uh, it is a special dimension. So let's see how to do this screw in SolidWorks. It is very easy and simple. Now let's start here. Choose front plane sketch. <coughs> First select a line and start from origin point. Draw a horizontal line then little taper just convert it or exit select three point arc and it should be now select this uh, center point of this arc and this line merge now let's define it overall length uh, let's make 28 mm nine mm let's make this degree 45 mm two point five mm okay now define this gap one point nine mm middle distance four mm and the distance from here to end point it must be twenty two point five mm okay now let's define this 7 mm five point five mm now select this radius keep twenty five mm okay <coughs> now this is the geometry of special screw it's the drawing is fully defined so just go to features and select revolve boss base command this bottom line select as a axis you can see it took the shape this is the preview of revolve select ok now you can see it here we will do one thing just uh, we will assign the go to appearance metal and polished steel I prefer to use polished steel and here you will select here you will see here real view graphics it's open and shadow in shaded mode also open now select fillet 0.5 mm and select this age ok choose chamfer point 0.3 mm and select this top face ok that's it now here we want to make some grooves or some knurling shape so select this face a sketch normal first draw a center line exit choose a line connect with this line select this line and this point make relation midpoint ok keep angle 90 degree let's make this vertical distance 0.2 mm ok now let's extrude cut 
सी हियर कीप हियर थ्रू ऑल ओके नाउ सी वी क्रिएटेड ए ग्रुप फॉर नर्लिंग नर्लिंग नाउ वी वॉन्ट टू मेक नंबर ऑफ पैटर्न सो जस्ट सेलेक्ट हियर सर्कुलर पैटर्न directly select this cut out extruded cut choose one circular face select this circular face uh, 80 number is sufficient for this drawing equal spacing okay now you can see it looks a uh, beautiful now here we want to make a cut out for this so let's select this face plane select this plane two two faces we selected one tangent and one parallel select okay now select this plane a sketch normal choose here center rectangle and draw a rectangle from origin point Let, let's define make the length 15 mm and the width 1.5 mm this is the groove for a screw driver okay now let's extrude it choose here offset from surface keep 7 select the offset from surface select this surface see this offset is 7 mm from this surface select okay delete we want to cut extrude not select extruded cut now select offset from surface now select this back surface 7 mm okay now see just hide this plane the grooves are created here choose chamfer select this inside face 0.5 fillet 0.2 mm and select inside edge okay now here we want to create some hole choose top plane sketch first draw a center line exit draw a circle here and let's make the diameter 1.5 mm and select the circle and this edge and keep the outer distance 5.5 mm okay and select extruded cut and select here through all both direction see it will cut a throughout hole okay now see a throughout hole is now let's we want to create one axis in this circle so select this circle and uh, choose here axis see here this axis we can see it here okay now select front plane sketch we want to make some cut out here <coughs> draw a connect with this line exit now let's define 1.3 mm and 0.5 mm okay now delete this coincident point and you can just drag little up 
ओके अप टू दिस एक्सिस बेटर नाउ लेट्स ड्रॉ ए सेंटर लाइन ए हॉरिजॉन्टल सेंटर लाइन सेलेक्ट मिरर एंटिटी एंड सेलेक्ट दिस लाइंस मिरर अबाउट दिस हॉरिजॉन्टल लाइन सी हियर इज गोइंग टू मिरर ओके choose distance and select this upper line both direction key 14.2 mm now see the drawing is fully defined so select here go to features and select revolve cut clear this axis select this line as a axis this vertical line so that it will cut inside select here okay now hide this line axis now you can see here we created this hole now the last section we need to make some thread here so first we have to create a plane choose plane select this face and this vertex make sure it is coincide or parallel to this okay select this plane a sketch and draw here a circle keep the diameter 4.019 mm okay now first we want to create a path for thread so <coughs> choose here helix and spiral pitch and revolution pitch 0.8 mm and revolution 12 mm 180 degree clockwise okay now let's choose top plane a sketch normal now hide this plane now here we will make the profile connect with a sketch select this mid line construction line again choose and make one more relation vertical now let's define the angle first 65 degree select this length 0.8 okay now choose this line this path shift key and this corner and make relation pierce see this geometry is fully defined so simply exit from the sketch go to feature and find out one command shift cut now you can see here the profile already selected just select the path it's calculated select okay now here this is the our thread so this is the m5 decorative screw now this is screw is completed so this is the simple decorative screw we are using in many furniture or in many places for decoration i hope you like it please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks Don't forget to share and like our videos. Thanks for watching.